Today I have 10 insider saving secrets for Amazon.com plus how to score insane secret clearance deals on their website. Welcome back to the channel. I'm the deal guy, Matt Granite. If you like the content that I'm about to share with you or you enjoy it while you're watching, please give this video a thumbs up, subscribe, turn your notifications on. It lets me know that you want more content like this. I just wrapped a series of the top secrets to help you save at Target and Walmart and I'm looking to learn about more stores. So if there's a store that you wanna save money at, got Costco on the way, many other deal drops. Let me know where it is you wanna save money. If you're not a Prime member, I'm going to have deals and ways to actually work the Amazon.com website to your advantage. Let's begin first with a reminder that there are a lot of links that I'm going to share tied to today's deals. Rather than waste your time spelling out each of the links as we go through the top 10 saving secrets, they're all available on mattsdailydeals.com. I do use affiliate links, which means I benefit monetarily if you are kind enough to use one of my links. And while I do host programming as an independent contractor for Amazon. I'm not speaking on behalf of the company, nor are they endorsing anything that I'm going to share with you. In fact, I think this is information Amazon might prefer I don't share with you. Reminder too, if you want to become a Prime member, there is a free 30-day trial to help you out with that, and that link is on mattsdailydeals.com. Plus, during today's video, if you watch closely, I'm going to give you hundreds of clippable coupons that will save you what could be thousands of dollars over the course of a year. All of these deals and all of these coupons are all part of this video that I'm going to share with you right now. Insider saving secret number one, there is a page on Amazon where many of the best deals happen to be hidden and a lot of you might not know this page actually exists. There's a special section of Amazon.com called Bargain Finds. And these prices include standard shipping, and of course the rates may differ by destination. But if you've never even seen a message like this, chances are you haven't seen the page. And many of these products range from $3 to about $20. There's some anomalies and some good products. This watch on your own exists at $12.99 and it's literally impossible to find a listing for this in stock on Amazon, the main page, if you do a search, at least at the time that I'm recording this. And there's deals for all sorts of people. Throughout this video, I'm gonna show you how to save money on all types of things, how to find hidden coupons, and of course, some really good deals. But just as an example, on another $13 deal, on the Bargain Finds page, this two outlet wall mount with the dual USB charge ports is $12.99. When I go to the main section of Amazon, I'm seeing this for 35% higher. So just throwing that out there as something that you might need to know as a great way to save money. Even a decently rated $2.98 pair of in-ear wired earbuds if you find yourselves traveling or if you don't have a Bluetooth connection or you're doing a lot of Skype or Zoom and you just want to hardwire into a computer, this $2.98 deal with free shipping would be another example as my savings secret number one. Insider, saving secret number two, and I feel like an idiot every time I just keep going like this, but I don't have fancy graphics because this is a frugal YouTube channel. The saving secret number two is tied to the trade-in page. Now, some of you know you can actually trade in pre-existing devices where Amazon will handle the return shipping to them for free, and then you'll get that credit toward an additional device. But what you might not know is they actually run promotions on a special version of the trade-in page. So for example, if you were to trade in a select cell phone, you'll get a bonus on an Amazon gift card. If you were to trade in an old e-reader, you get 20% off a new Kindle e-reader, and that's on top getting cash back for the e-reader you're already trading in. If you have an old Fire tablet, you can trade that in. Fire TV devices, like if you have an old Fire TV stick, and you wanna trade that in, again, huge savings. You can also get an Amazon gift card plus 25% off a new Echo device. And just to show you how the trade-in process works, it's actually seamless. You select what it is you wanna trade in. In this example, I have a first generation old used Blink indoor home security system. You answer a few questions about it. And not only am I getting 50 bucks back for trading in my new system, but I could get an additional discount off of the second generation if I choose to buy it for that respective product line. So you might be thinking, well, it's 50 bucks. I paid more at the time. Hey, it's more money back in your pocket where it belongs. Saving secret number three, bookmark the sales section of the Amazon warehouse page. I'm sure many of you guys know that there are plenty of gold box deals that have a wide range of discounts. Some of them are good, some of them are not fully worth your while at all times. And some of the products that end up in the gold box in today's deal section are listings that are dead. It's not a great way to sort deals, especially this product. 
but you'll likely note the Amazon warehouse section is better organized and also has deals that are in stock. So for the warehouse products, not all of these are used. Some of these are products that have just been repackaged. Sometimes if something's shipping to you at your home from point A to point B and the box is deemed to be damaged, which might mean scuffed up, might be a dent in the package, Amazon then receives that on the back end, repackages it and sends it back out as a renewed or warehouse product. And that's what we're looking at for some of these deals. So if we were to look right now, there's a select number of deals but something like this Bissell or even this Eufy Anchor Robovac right now is selling for $147 versus what could be 230 or more if you were to purchase this product as brand new. And again, all of these prices that I'm showing you will differ depending on when you're watching this and what's on sale at Amazon at that particular time. But this is a 50% off deal right now on a very well rated vacuum, as you can see, and a number one bestseller. So that is interesting to note. And one of the reasons you may want to bookmark that warehouse deals section. And I'm going to give you a saving secret addition right here, a bit of a bonus. Once you're in the warehouse section, pay attention to the Woot deals. You guys remember Woot used to be a daily deal website and then Amazon purchased Woot. And now there are all sorts of daily deals that run on the website. A lot of these are refurbished and used products, but it's worth a look. For example, on this i5 MacBook Pro, there are some great savings on this specific product if you were to log on right now. And you are going to find different products that are brand new as well and worth your while. For example, this UV clean phone sanitizer is 49 bucks. I actually have a deal for a phone sanitizer that I much prefer on mattsdailydeals.com, but just as an example, that's there. Some of the deals are good, some aren't. This bamboo four piece luxury sheet set, brand new. 17 to $23 is good. If you want higher end sheets, that might not be your pick. And just as an example on mattsdailydeals.com, I think I found a sheet set at $100 off. It depends what you're looking for, but of course that would be a good thing to keep in mind. R is part of Amazon's brand new renewed program. And the deals in this section primarily tied to electronics and desktops are the most aggressive of anything that I've ever seen. Now I am completely not in favor of just buying a renewed or refurbished product from anyone. In fact, for a lot of those daily deal websites you see, there's no accountability if something goes wrong with the product. The reason I like Apple refurbished products when you buy directly from Apple and renewed products that you buy directly from Amazon is there's an additional guarantee. If you look right now, this is an amazing deal. This is a desktop computer with an Intel Core quad processor, an i5, 16 gigs of RAM, which is absolutely insane, and a brand new 480 gig solid state drive for $229, 54% off. Guys, that is one of the best desktop deals. I had one last week that I featured from the Amazon Renewed section as well, which was 150 and almost loaded up as well as this. But why am I showing you this section? Well, all of the products from the Amazon Renewed section, and a reminder, I've bookmarked all of these sections on mattsdailydeals.com, is a product that is backed by an additional 90-day Amazon Renewed guarantee. The product has been professionally tested, it's inspected, and it's tested by Amazon qualified suppliers to ensure that it looks like new and performs forms well. On certain products, it's actually better to buy it renewed because your typical return window for an Amazon purchase is 30 days. When you buy an Amazon renewed product, even if it's just been repackaged, you're getting 90 days if anything goes wrong with it. And that's actually better and working to your advantage as a consumer. And hey, it could score you a deal on something like a brand new iPhone. Again, you're saving $80 right now for something that's fully unlocked that you could take advantage of and score that additional 90 day renewed guarantee. Now I realize many products have manufacturer warranties, but these days with everything going on, it's not that easy to call up the manufacturer and get the service and get everything scheduled. Sometimes just going back to the place at which you purchase the product from like Amazon is a great way to go. So these renewed products, really something to consider. Insider saving secret number five is you absolutely do not need to be a prime member. If your main reason for using that prime membership is free shipping. A lot of people don't know this, but the average shipping time for a non-prime product is between five and eight days. If you spend over $25, most products on Amazon will ship completely for free. And if you are shopping for something that's available from a third party and fulfilled by that third party, you'll often just get free shipping. So the prime membership may not be worth your while. And with that being said, if you're not using prime video and some of the other benefits, which I'll discuss in a few moments, getting 
anything into your shopping cart and bundling it together so it's over $25 will get you shipping within that five to eight day window. And at least at the time that I'm recording this video, there are widespread delays based on what's going on with Amazon shipping times. And that prime one to two day free shipping doesn't really hold true at least right now in my community and with many zip codes with which I've tested this. Again, everything's different. Not speaking on behalf of Amazon shipping times, just on behalf of personal experience. Saving secret number six. I'm sure you guys might have noticed that you can't use manufacturer coupons at Amazon. You can't just submit them to customer service and have them applied to an order. But did you know there are coupons galore all waiting for you in a not so obvious section of Amazon.com? I'm not going to call this a secret section, but I am going to say the vast majority of people do not know to click this. They don't know the link exists and they don't know that you can actually score all sorts of coupons that you can then apply to future purchases. Well, I realize a dollar off here, or a dollar there might not get you overly excited. And I realize I have no life and very few friends except for the amazing subscribers of this channel. You're not going to believe some of the coupons that I'm going to show you right now all located in this section. So it does tell you that you can save up to 35% off with Amazon coupons. And yeah, a dollar here might not get you that excited and it's probably something you've seen before. But let's use headphones as an example and you're not going to believe some of the coupons I show you. So on this first pair of headphones, you're saving an extra 20% off when you apply this coupon. This is a big deal and this will add up relatively quickly for you on another pair of headphones just as an example. 20% off. Why would you pay $39.99 for this very well rated pair of headphones when you could save an additional 20%? How about this pair of earbuds? $10 guys when you apply the coupon. It's all about knowing these coupons exist. And one of my main missions is to make sure you always get your coupons. So a reminder, everything is linked for you, mattsdailydeals.com. You can join my email newsletter, click the coupons, but whatever it is, just make sure you're using a coupon when you shop. And this is information I have bookmarked for you. Insider saving secret number seven, know the source of your products to get the best deal. So I wanna give you an example. Not everything you see on Amazon is of course at its lowest price. And if you look very carefully, when you are shopping for a product, it usually comes from another brand. And these brands sometimes have their own websites where you can save even more money if you go directly to their websites. So let's use this cooling pillow as an example. If you look very closely at the listing, you're getting a two pack of well-rated cooling pillows in the small size. I know it's very confusing. It's a small or extra large, but it's actually small. You're getting two small pillows for 79 bucks. Well, if you want two extra large pillows, for $99.98, which is likely the better value. If you went directly to the merchant, you would have saved yourself a little bit of money or at least got something better. And if that example is not clear enough to you, let's use this. There's a hose right here, which is an expandable 50 foot hose, highly in demand right now. This same hose, which is $39.99 on Amazon is actually available online from the merchant directly for 29 bucks. If you look at my website, mattsdailydeals.com, and you scroll through all of the deals that I have featured recently, I actually hunted this down at a cheaper price. $29.99 versus the $10 more you would spend on Amazon. Why? Well, it's not that Amazon's out to hurt you, but they do have credit card processing fees and different fees that are passed along to the merchant. And in that case, many merchants will actually jack up their prices on Amazon, even if they're on sale, just to cover their operating costs. Saving secret number eight, know your rights. If you're a Prime member, you are paying for a promise that you're going to get most products within a specific window of time. And if you're not getting your products within two to three days or five days or whatever break you wanna to cut to the people in your community, which is totally fine and I support that, you still are promised some type of shipping time. And many of the products these days that I've been ordering are sometimes getting lost, as you can see from this. And at other times, I'm waiting three weeks for something that was a prime product that was supposed to arrive in three to five days. Contact Amazon customer service and ask for a credit for that month. Your prime membership could cost you around 13 bucks a month. You should be paying for something you're not getting back as a service. So ask for a credit. Those are your rights. Amazon customer service I have found is very receptive to providing those breaks to people. Just make sure you advocate for yourself. Saving secret number nine, there are discounts available on the Prime Membership Program. If you are a student or you have a Medicaid card, you can save a lot on Prime. 50% off per month with a qualifying EBT card. And if you're a student, you get a six month trial 
for free. After that, Prime Student resumes at $6.49 per month. That is an amazing deal on the Amazon Prime membership. And what you might not know is there's actually other plans available. So for example, if you are not a student and you don't have a Medicaid card, Prime Annual is 119 per year at the time I'm recording this, which gives you Prime Video, ad-free music streaming, unlimited photo storage, unlimited reading, and various other things which we'll talk about. And again, if you wanna use a free 30-day trial, there is a link, mattsdailydeals.com. If you are a monthly member, you spend actually a little bit more than on the annual membership commitment. And if you simply just wanna use the Prime Video service, it's $8.99 per month, which puts it on par or better value compared to Netflix, but again, you have to like the catalog of programming and that's different per person watching. In fact, if you guys are watching right now, do you love Prime Video? Do you use it? Are you more of a Netflix person? Let me know about that as I make my way through saving secret number 10. This is all tied to whether or not you actually need Prime. In the math that I've done, if you buy more than three items per month from Amazon, and those are your shopping habits, you are 100% the perfect person to use that Prime membership because all of the benefits over time, especially for larger scale deliveries and the discounts passed along to you, generally at least allow your Prime membership to pay for itself plus a few other bonuses. And the reason I'm telling you that is, for example, if you shop for food, your grocery savings are huge as a Prime member. If you have a growing family, the Amazon family discounts of 20% on diapers and baby food subscriptions make it worth it. And there are exclusive deals for you in addition to deals which become available as early access deals to Prime members. The daily deals and early access to some of the most popular products, especially around occasions like Black Friday and Cyber Monday and Prime Day are all tied to your Prime membership. And crazy things like if you're a Prime member and you place an order through your Echo, there's sometimes additional savings that you can unlock. And these are all topics upon which I focus throughout the year, but insider savings for Prime members might make it worth your while. And if you do have a growing family, or in my case, I'm a proud father of a two-year-old, before my two-year-old got to being a toddler rather than a baby, the baby registry on Amazon gives tons of discounts to family members. The free welcome box is up to $35 worth of products. And then just for completing a registry, you get a discount on items that are left in your registry if people don't buy it, plus Prime members receive 15% off on that. And these startup costs for a growing family are a lot of money. There are similar incentives in place at Walmart, and of course, I've covered all of the shopping secrets for Walmart, including how to read their price tags and what you need to know and what not to buy from them in another upload. If there's another store that you want me to cover, please leave me a comment. And if you've watched this and you're wondering, should you cancel your Prime membership? What are the hidden perks of your Prime membership? These are also all topics that I've covered on this channel. And if you like what you saw, thumbs up to me will be so helpful. And thank you again for subscribing with your notifications turned on. I love you guys for watching. Have a great rest of your week.